Hello YouTube world, hope everyone's doing well and coping with the social distancing and staying safe. This video is made especially for Leo Benitez and I want to share with you Leo on how I got my wing to talk with my door. I am using Cakewalk by Bandlab and I'm using it on the Windows 10 platform. What you do need to do first of all to get everything talking to each other you need to connect your wing with a regular USB cable to your computer. Now the USB cable needs to go into the back directly into the motherboard. Do not use the ports on the front. Do not use a, um, a dock. This will really put you in a world of hurt i learned the hard way go directly to a dedicated usb connection in your motherboard and that's half the battle right there the second thing you need to do i cannot answer for mac users i don't use a mac i think um it will be directly plug and play with a mac a mac may auto sense it but check on that that's what i believe i heard but as far as windows machines goes you do need to get the USB driver from the download section on the wing portion of the website. Once you do get the USB drivers downloaded and installed, you're going to see what I'm looking at right now on the audio devices. You should see all these several wing USB ASO drivers listed. Now, what I have done, I have checked everything labeled USB wing ASO for both in and outputs. So everything wing and anything not wing remains unchecked. Okay, what that should give you when you're recording audio in Cakewalk, again, I'm doing this with my phone, so sorry about the shaky. Um, you will see your wing and all the associated inputs. Now I have a keyboard plugged into the local ins one and two on those combo XLR jacks and I have a Roland Integra 7 on three and four so let's say I wanted to record something on my keyboard I'll be going here I'll be picking that stereo connection it says in one but really it does mean one and two because it's a stereo connection so take its word for that what I want to do is put input echo on and arm the track for recording and as I said in my previous video for recording you do need to go to your wing and be in a setup menu you want to hit main, main to record and alt to play back. So we're here on the wing, sorry, on the computer, I should say, going to zoom out a little bit. Let's go ahead and hit record. There we go. Going to disarm the track, go back to the wing, alt and that devices, which is a USB, and I should have playback. Okay, I believe we could do the same if the Input echo is turned on, so let's uh, get rid of that. And we're still in alternate. I want to try this for kicks and giggles. We got input echo on. We've armed the track. And we are on alt on the setup section on the wing. Let's go ahead and hit record. Okay, so I guess you can go either way, but I found out a little addendum to my previous video 
make sure you've got your input echo on and you are golden so so that's how I set my cakewalk up to be able to use the wing as a audio interface so Leo I hope this helps you out and I hope it helps others out too in the meantime everyone stay safe and I'll catch you next go round. Bye bye.